Tempo. Sagittarius, hello, it's Guiding Halo here. This is going to be your reading for uh, August 17th, 18th, the new moon. So it's a whole cycle that goes through um, a month. So to the next new moon. So let's see what's coming your way. Now, this is a challenger for you. We got it upside down, the camel boy, small steps asking for help. So perhaps there's something that you really want to go it alone and move forward but there needs to be balance in what you can create and expect yourself to create on your own without help from others we are in the time with gemini in the north node so i believe that it's about community this is a challenger because it was upside down the camel boy challenges you to stop the course of action you're on and get busy with mundane chores Nothing can happen right now to move you forward in your inquiry. This confirmation from the cat. <laughs> Any more quickly. This is time to chop wood or ca and carry water. Attend to your home, wash your car, and declutter your closets. A spring cleaning is in order. You may also need a spring cleaning in your thoughts. Meditation would help you too. That said, if you do all the small things now, the big ones are accomplished as if by magic. And always when you've stopped trying to do it all at once and all by yourself. Another message is a warning to stop attempting to accomplish everything single-handedly, expecting that no one will ever come to help. Try letting them. Now is the time to relinquish control, my Sagittarian friends. All right, let's get an angel message. Camel boy. Ask for help. Try and you don't need to work at all on your own. New psychic and spiritual experiences are changing the way you view the world and yourself. Allow your spiritual gifts to open through study, prayer, and meditation. So the divine is leveling you up spiritually and psychically, apparently. How you view things. That whole shift in energy, that awakening, that's going to be coming from the divine for you. Okay, you here, person, place, or thing here, and underneath is what the divine's trying to get through to you. So there's been an ending, feeling stabbed in the back. But seeing, I think this is, you know, seeing the, the sun starting to rise after the whole commotion. Sun will come out again. Communication coming in about this ending or something that has happened from that ending. And it's something that may make you want to take control of the situation or you're dealing with a boss, a CEO, a grandfather figure, a patriarch of a family. This could also be a judge as well. So an ending happened, communication going to this person about it. What's this ending and communication about, please? Three-party situation or a celebration. Someone's celebrating a oh, retirement, maybe? Someone's having a retirement party or will celebrate their retirement. <clears throat> I almost feel like someone feels cheated by their job place here, though. It's going to take them a long time to build something forward, but it's something that uh, can, can really take you for the long haul. You're feel ba feeling battle-worn. It's like, do I have it left in me to do so? That's what I'm getting. One more card for this communication, please. Yeah, turning your back on a situation, wanting to manifest your ships coming in in a different direction. So someone may be leaving a job behind, letting their employer know they're doing so. But, and it's because they're battle-worn and weary over it, they, they see that their ships can come in much easier elsewhere. Okay, 
Not seeing the positive in that situation, I would say the Emperor says, how about we give you a raise? How about we have communication? How about we give you a new, a new something? And you're like, well, that could be a brand new start. Could be. Perhaps there's a little bit of grieving over even making this choice for yourself. And so a brand new idea comes in, which is a huge start because you have everything in your arsenal to create it. It's creating a new visionary stance for your life, my Sagittarian friends. That's what, that's what it looks like it's happening here. Being that match that strikes the matchbox and lights that fire within you, bringing a new vision for your life. Yeah, absolute wish granted. Look at that. That's beautiful. Sometimes we know it's time to move on in life and, and forward and there is a celebration, but there still can be grieving and sadness over the situation. I think you're going to have a more playful, fun time. Like new ideas about your passions and how to move forward, new ideas that are going to really make you emotional, make you feel more whole inside. What's going on underneath here? Options. The divine's bringing in many options, so there's some sort of illusion. Uh, yeah, there's some sort of illusion with all of the options around, and I think you're going to be cutting them. Cutting the fog of illusion with your sword and saying, you know what, I'm going to pick the one that resonates most with me. I'm going to move forward and I might be up in my head about it all night, but I'm going to do it anyway. <laughs> Did I do the right thing? Did I pick the right one? I don't know. Like, I want to take control of the situation, but oh, what if I'm in this energy? I caramba. So the divine's helping you work through it behind the scenes and in your emotions and at night. Worried about, am I lying to myself? Can I actually make this new thing happen? Was I stolen from? Should I have gone back? All of these things. Walking away. I know I walked away from a lot of bullshit, so that's good. But like, yeah, I'm holding on. I'm holding back. I'm nervous about this whole new start, man. That's what I'm getting for you guys, my Sagittarian friends. Nervous about a whole new start. Challenging ideas, challenging truth. But we have new starts all over the board here. Look at this. This is a new start in communication. This is a new start in communication, as is this. Something you can use your knowledge to create. Something you can use your passions to dig into. And something that will bring you emotional fulfillment. And I think it's going to surprise you. Got a wish granted here. That's nothing to sniff your nose at. I'm telling you, it's got to do something with your psychic knowledge and experiences that you have already. Yeah. Beautiful reading. I love you guys. I'll talk to you again soon. Blessings.